you're missing the point. My point is, I'm living my hell and earth right here, okay, right now. Craig, Craig, um, are you an atheist? No, no, no. Um, I believe in a higher power, uh -huh. but see, we, I could, we could go on forever right here. The higher power is within you. Huh? Okay. Don't squeeze me. <laughs> <laughs> you hurt your fingers. Be careful. Yes. Okay. Um, gosh. Your God is within you, I believe. Okay. Okay. So, Craig, would you consider yourself to be a good person? I try to be. Okay, can I ask you a few questions to see if what it's What goes around comes around. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Can I ask you a few questions sure, to see if you're a sure, good person? Sure. Have you ever told a lie? Of course. What does that make you? I'm still a good person. Yeah, but what are you called if you tell a lie? You're a liar. That's it. Have you ever stolen something, even if it's small? Um, yes. But what does that make you? A thief. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. As a child. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. And um, have you ever used God's name in vain? Depend on what God you're talking oh, about. God's name. God's name is. <laughs> yes, I That's called blasphemy. Yes. yes. And it's using God's name to express disgust, yes, which is a yes, very serious yes, sin. Yes, yes. Um, now Jesus said, "Whoever looks upon a woman to lust after her, has committed adultery already with her in his heart." Well, do I look at these beautiful women here and lust for them? Surely I do. Okay, <laughs> Craig. By your own admission, you're a lying, thieving, blasphemous and adulterer. Blasphemous adulterer. Yes. And you have to face God on Judgment Day. Yes. And God gave you a conscience, so you know right from wrong. So when you stand before God on the Day of Judgment, do you think you'll be innocent or guilty if He judged you by the standard of the Ten Commandments? But I've already told you, I'm living my hell and earth right now as we speak. Uh -huh. There's no Judgment Day for me. Yeah, I'll say it again, okay. I'll use the word if. If God judges you by the Ten Commandments, yes. bearing in mind... I would burn in hell for eternity. Would you be innocent or guilty? I would be guilty. You'd go to hell? I would burn in hell for eternity now, does, if does, I stood before God, as you said, and be judged. I would be guilty as hell. Does that concern you? No, it doesn't. It concerns me. Would you sell one of your eyes? You've got a magnificent no, no. body. I wouldn't sell an eye or a limb. No, I wouldn't. Okay, because you... I need them to get through. Yeah. <laughs> so, Craig, yes. your eyes are priceless to you. Would you sell both for 50 million? No, I wouldn't. And, and you say, I don't mind if I go to hell. When your soul is more valuable than your eyes, your life is the most valuable thing you've got. Jesus said this. What shall a profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses his own soul? You could die tonight, and you're saying, I don't care if I go to hell? No, you're missing the point. My point is, I'm living my hell and earth right here, okay, right now, okay? You having a good time? I'm having a good time. Today is a pleasant day, uh -huh. okay? And I do have hellish days, okay? I will not be judged at the end. There's no Are you end. sure? Hey, don't go. i got to tell you something. <laughs> yes, sir. One more real important thing. Craig, God gave you a conscience so you know right from wrong. Yes. So he wrote his law upon your heart. You know it's wrong to lie. You know it's wrong to steal. You know it's wrong to lust. You know it's wrong to blaspheme. And kill. Yeah, and kill. So on the day of judgment, it'll be without excuse. Now, you know what God did so you I wouldn't I thought we already that. clarified that it wouldn't be no judgment day for me. <laughs> oh, there is. There's going to be, whether we believe in it or not. So right. now, after I told you a dollar bill, are you going to preach to me? Are we preaching a <laughs> yeah, sermon no. here or what? i got to finish what I'm going to. Give me 10 minutes because it's so important. 10 minutes? Two, no, two, no. two, 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 two. I won't hurt you. Okay. Hang in there. You don't need to be intimidated by me. You know what God did so you wouldn't have to go to hell? Yes. He sent his son, born of a woman, to die on the cross for you. Yes. Whether you believe in the hell or judgment or not, Jesus Christ suffered and died for your sin, what for my sin. What religion are you? Christian. Okay, I yeah. Sure. And, and I'm the, born a Christian anyhow. Well, you've got to be but born, I've changed you've up. You've got to be born again, John chapter 3. So when Jesus died on the cross, he took the punishment for your sins. Yeah. And if you repent and trust in Jesus, God will forgive every sin you committed okay. and you'll escape the damnation of hell. That's the gospel. And I wouldn't lie to you. I don't want you to go to hell. No, you don't. God doesn't want you to go so, to hell. So you're going to help me right now? Yeah, I'll give you a million dollars. You gave it to me and I gave it back. <laughs> Do you have a Bible at home, Craig? I have plenty of them. Oh, please check it out. I wouldn't lie to you. I'm telling the gospel truth. Hey, man, thank you for talking to me. My pleasure. I, really I appreciate it. Thank yeah, you very much. Yeah, yeah. All right. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you.